Okay, what is going on everybody? This is gonna be a super weird video because I'm literally filming this on the internet of my Xbox, which I don't know why it's not like full screen. Like there's like black bars all the way on the screen. Either way, I just saw this here and I was mind blown. We have, I have a couple things to say about this. First of all, is this, is this real? I don't know, I haven't read this article yet. I just saw that there was a leaked production model ready Cybertruck. And if this is it, if this is actually what it looks like, I might have to cancel my order because this, it looks terrible. This is garbage. I'm so mad that A, the wheels look like that. B, do you see the giant, ugly, obnoxious, one giant wiper on the driver's side of the windshield? And it is so big. And the mirrors, why? What is up with these mirrors? And why does it look like they put like it's got like a front bumper now like it's not like that front like smooth metal look there's like a bumper and like the skirts what are these Gange rock slider skirt things before i start actually roasting this too much is this real let's see so this is on inside evs and it says production ready looking tesla cybertruck beta breaks cover it looks slightly different to the past prototypes we saw, and it's undeniably closer to the final production look. No, I don't like this now. It took me this long to like how it looked before. It's so ugly. First of all, please leave a like for my pain here because I am like high key heartbroken. This is like devastating. I wanted this thing and this is what they're trying to make it look like? This is terrible. What's going on here? Let's, let's read into this. Tesla really wants to start Cybertruck production although it's not clear when. They don't even know when this thing's actually gonna come out. The most recent estimate is early 2023, although there's a chance it will still debut sometime this year. So maybe there's hope, I don't know. Progress on the electric pickup is continuing. So it's as shown by this prototype, snapped by a Tesla employee, which looks pretty much production ready. No, I don't want that to be production, no. <laughs> It has the single windscreen wiper whose rest position is vertical. It looks much more nicely integrated than before. Right next to the left A-pillar, a pair of big traditional side mirrors that appear to be unpainted plastic, no visible door handles, wheels that look, wait, 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 wheels that look the arrow set. Wheels that look the arrow set. Okay, I'm not reading that wrong. Whoever wrote this, a little bit of a typo there, no big deal, but wheels that look the arrow set from the model 3 without the arrow covers and are a very interesting possibility for the frunk opening some have said that the vehicle looks a bit smaller than the one tesla originally showed and this may be the case although rumor has it that the manufacturer may in fact offer two sizes of Cybertruck. Maybe Tesla ended up not doing that and just made one Cybertruck that's not quite as big as the study. What the f***? But it's also not 20% smaller as the rumor claimed. I'm not sure what they're on about in that there, but Tesla may have also reduced the size of the front end, increasing the size of the windscreen. It really looks like there's no way to open the front, but the vehicle will surely have one, and it's been speculated that the entire front end may lift out of the way, light bar and all. A clamshell design, which is probably the only solution. We can't quite see the seams where the opening is, at least not in this one photo. Okay, so they're just like, it's the author of this article, and he's just kind of breaking down the image, like, and what he's, kind of like what I did, how I'm screaming, but he's typing it. The Cybertruck also has a larger opening in the front bumper and the entire bumper appears to be a bit bigger and lower than before. This probably helps with this aero credentials, but it also probably limits uh, its approach angle off-road, although we can't quite tell how much lower the bumper actually is. It also doesn't have any kind of visible door handles, even though some older prototypes did feature them. The original study did have some flush door handles that popped out when the vehicle was unlocked, but it seems Tesla has moved away from that design and it seems to confirm the rumors that announced this. Regarding the wheels, they're not sure what size they are. The tires don't look like they're 35s, so we may say they're a bit smaller, possibly 33s. And the rims could be the ones the vehicle will be sold with, although they will surely get some sort of aero cover to match the vehicle's style. Okay, so there, there it is. Are the, the covers that I'm talking about originally that I was complaining about from the get-go, are those actually just covers? So I'm gonna switch the tab over I'm trying to look at the tire. Is it the same tire that they're using over here? I don't think it's the same tire. These are the aero covers. Are these the aero covers? I can't tell. I really hope that, I really want my Cybertruck to have those wheels right there. 
However they got the wheel to look like that, I want it to look like that. And as you can see, in this photo here, there's no wiper sticking out on the side of the driver's side of the windshield, and there's no mirrors. I didn't like it when I first saw it, and then I started to like it. And then they did all this weird, ugly stuff to it, and now it's weird and ugly. Everyone look at the bumper, the wheels, and the, where the wiper is on the top of the windshield here. So let's go ahead and take a look at this other one. And I'm trying to see myself, how much bigger is the bumper? Is it actually taller? And what's up with this, what's up with this like rock slider looking thing? Oh, it does have it. Okay, so the actual Cybertruck did have that. That's what's up with the Cybertruck. So I know a lot of people have been asking me like in the comments, uh, what Cybertruck update? What's going on with the Cybertruck? So that's about as much as I know as well. 2023, I have no idea. Also, is there rumors of a uh, quad motor type thing? Let's see. I want to I wanna show you guys this. Tesla Cybertruck quad motor option is coming, says Elon Musk. Rumor has that the Cybertruck is no longer configurable on the Tesla site because they're debating getting rid of the single motor version and only having the two, three, and four motor variants. I am going to be so upset. I have a full self-driving tri-motor Cybertruck on pre-order. And I thought the triple motor was the best one they had. If they make me cancel the triple without letting me upgrade to the quad, I'm going to be so mad because I have full self-driving locked in at $8,000. Oh my God, I'm on the website now. I can't even, it doesn't even tell me how much full self-driving and stuff cost. Wow. If they snake me out of my $8,000 full self-driving and not let me upgrade to the quad motor with full self-driving for the same price, I'm going to be so mad. You know what? How much is full self-driving right now? Full self-driving is $12,000 now. I swear. Oh, I'm going to raise hell. I'm going to raise hell if I have to pay 12 grand for full self-driving instead of eight because I have a pre-order at eight thousand dollar full self-driving i am not paying 12 this is it i'm sick of elon i'm sick of elon and his bullshit comment below if you know what i'm talking about ah i i really want to like the guy but god he's like so far off with his targets now he's playing games with my heart come on elon come on elon dude okay i don't even know what's going on here how much will the quad motor cost the official price point for quad motor is unknown but we can assume it will be more than the tri-motor and similarly priced to the Hummer EV quad motor model, which has this, the GM competitor costs upwards of a hundred grand, offers a thousand horsepower, a thousand torque. Could the EV Hummer be the reason for the quad motor addition? I don't know. Ah, Elon out here playing games, dude. What are you doing? I was really excited for the Cybertruck. Now I don't know. Do I just cut my losses and get a Model S or something? I really don't know. This is so ugly. This is, ah, uh, I don't want to see this in my driveway. Like, that is literally an eyesore. This looks like AJ made it. This looks like AJ took tin snips and, like, cut metal from Logan Steel Bargain Barn. Like, that's what this looks like. Ah, I'm just flustered. I'm like, I'm at loss for words. That's why right when I saw this, I fired up the camera. I had to make a video because this, a big thing that I wanted. I wanted the Cybertruck. We were told it was coming out 2022, whatever. Now it's 2023. Now it looks different. What's next, Elon? What's next?